Hi everyone, in today's video we're going to talk about these supposed power savers that you plug into a socket in your house and then they save you money on your monthly electricity bill. Now most people already know that these don't work and they're a waste of money but some people still fall for it and I want to explain to you why they don't work and I want to explain to you how many people get tricked by this. So for today's example we've got this AC fan, let me turn it around so it doesn't disturb our audio and then I'll switch it on. So you can see if we were to run this for 8 hours a day, every day, it would cost us around 460 pesos a year. And this is how many people get tricked. They'll show you the voltage and they'll show you the current. And they'll say, okay, look, 0.119 amps. Let's plug in our special power saver. And then I say, wow, look at that. It's gone down to 0.075 amp. So that's X percentage and you're saving that much money on your electricity bill. But if you look at the estimated monthly cost, actually you're not saving money so although the current's gone down you're not saving money and the reason for that is that residential customers are charged for kilowatt hours so whether you have a good power factor or a bad power factor it makes no difference that's how these power savers actually work they're improving your power factor so 0.84 if i unplug it 0.5 something so you can see it's a worse power factor but our amount that we pay each year stays the same so let me put down on paper how this actually works. You can see our power being consumed is around 15 watts. Our voltage is around 236 volts. Our current is around 0.118 amp. And our power factor is 0.534. So how do we calculate how much this actually costs? Well, we do 236 times 0.118 times 0.534 and that if we do the math will come out to roughly 15 watts now let's plug in the power saver okay so again it's measuring around 15 watts and we take 236 volts let me make sure you can see this on the camera we have a current of around 0.075 amp so you can see the current has gone down. Our power factor is 0 0.847. So let's compute that. And again, it comes out to around 15 watts. So it doesn't matter if you use one of these power savers because you are being billed as a residential customer on kilowatt hours or watts. So that is the most important. So these power savers make absolutely no difference at all. Yes, it does reduce the current and that's what they always show you. Whenever they're trying to do a demonstration, they say, look, the current has gone down so much. You're gonna save 30%, 40% a year. But if you look at how you're billed and you understand how you're billed, you'll realize that it actually does not change anything. So if you have any questions, put them in the comment section down below. And if you enjoyed this video, please give a thumbs up and subscribe. Thanks for watching.